Now here's Eli everyone, looking much, much brighter, aren't you dear? Hey Eli, you feeling better buddy? Well, you come up close and personal, hello, you feeling a bit stronger now? Yeah, it was a bit scary wasn't it? You were cold and shivering and falling over. Hey, so the plan is to try and get him to feed himself and I found that sloppy food works better for him so I've soaked a bit of um, the proper dog kibble that's recommended. It doesn't have any grain in it. Yeah, it's recommended for rehabbing insectivore birds like Eli and he's just been wonderful and look at his wing. This is the injured wing on this side and he holds it beautifully now compared to before where it hung. So I'll just, oh, he doesn't want to show you, but oh, man, he said, there you go, look at that. That is a perfectly held wing. Wouldn't even know he had an injury. What do you reckon, uh, hey buddy, hey Eli, what do you reckon about that? healed up beautifully so it's a shame that he wasn't strong enough to get through the horrible weather and now we've got to just strengthen him up again get him really self-feeding perfectly and then we'll see where we go from there we won't do anything to harm his chance of survival so might have some decisions to make about a captive life but we're just taking it one day at a time and he just looks really good still a bit weak a bit tired but so much better than yesterday hey buddy do you want to say goodbye eli can i say bye bye everyone thanks for thinking of me eli Oi. why are you busy looking out the window oh and his parents haven't been coming up as much because now he's at the stage where they'd be thinking about moving him on to start a new cycle, a new baby, and they might even have a new baby in the nest. We're not too sure because now it's breeding season. Who's out there? So they've still hung around, but just not as intently as before. I saw Papa outside just a little while ago and gave him a little bit of food. Um, but yeah, so we'll just take it a day at the time, see how we go. Got him in a bigger crate thanks to Gillian. She's lent me this great dog crate and he'll stay in here just to recuperate. Alright, well that's all for now. So you can see he's doing remarkably well. Hey buddy. Yeah. Oh my little soldier. Yep. So he doesn't look sick. He looks quite healthy able to hold himself up on the perch and he's starting to eat by himself which is a big step from yesterday and we'll see how we go so okay it's a good update for now thanks for watching